thank you so very much for joining me tonight. Just want to have a little intro to our session here. Of course, I go by Lunanites. I'm a Reiki master teacher studying, practicing all different sorts of healing arts modalities and my personal belief, which I would never mean to encroach on you with, but just to share, my personal belief is that there's really so much power in the mind, like all is mind. The way we look at things, the way we connect with things, the way we release things, it's all a mental, the way we manifest things, it's all a mental game. It's an art. Of course, there are always things to do and things maybe not to do, you know, in our day-to-day -day lives that might support us all uniquely, individually, and collectively better. But our theme today is a little playful. It's a laissez-faire, I think I'm saying that wrong, but a laissez-faire aspect of manifesting. Connecting to letting things be done. Letting things work their way out while we continue on our paths doing what comes naturally to us without forcing things, without rushing things, without trying to stuff our feet into this glass slipper that it was not meant for us kind of thing, or maybe it's too soon. There are so many things behind the scenes working out. There are so many ways that your manifestations can unfold. So what we're connecting with in this session is a bit of trust and a bit of letting the behind the scenes do the work while we just excuse me, like just freaking enjoy ourselves, just live our lives, just, you know, focus on the things that make us happy and let that be our work first, trying to like really force something. Of course, I really believe you should listen to your instincts. If there's an idea you have, if there's an, like some pull, like do it. But at the same time, what we're focusing on here is a little paradoxical, right? But it's to just kind of chill out and let things unfold, get out of the way and see how things like start rolling and see how the tides change you might not even notice if you're doing it right you might not even notice until it's at your door and you're like oh dang <laughs> so i hope that you enjoy the session we just have a little sponsored portion here thank you so much to to you for again this might be my new catchphrase here when it comes to this but things are not getting mad when i pay my bills i hope you enjoy my sponsored content because i really do put a lot of effort into it and then i'll see you in the session thank you so very much to endel for sponsoring our video today i have been taking a serious cleanse from social media scrolling letting things into my subconscious and endel has been a big app for me to use while i go through this it's one of my absolute favorites the design is so simple and clean and easy to easy to use you never get lost in this app which you know that can happen from time to time you get distracted and then boom you're not in your <laughs> your cleanse anymore they simplify it with themes such as relax to calm your mind and create feelings of comfort and safety, focus which boosts your productivity by helping you concentrate for longer periods of time, sleep themes to soothe you into a deep sleep with soft gentle sounds and many others as well, a hibernation mode, movement and study as examples. Endel also partners with uh, different artists and creators such as James Blake, Grimes, Plastiman, <laughs> Alan Watts, and right now they have this rainy outside themed um, soundscape to cozy up to the gentle patter of rain blended with sleep aiding sounds. There's an awesome scenarios timer that I absolutely love to help me manage my time where you can select from deep work, chill, self-care, homework, meditate, yoga, power nap, read, chores, <laughs> create, workout, commute. Endel is neuroscience backed 
brainwave studies show that Endel provides the fastest, most consistent focus versus listening to playlists on streaming platforms. It supports your C circadian, I can never pronounce this word, circadian rhythms, supporting your biological clock, which is in tune with nature and the organic rhythms and cycles of nature. Endel complements these to improve how you feel day or night and their AI powered technology technology called Endel Pacific adapts in real time to personal inputs like location, weather, and heart rates. The first 100 people to download Endel at the link below in my video description will get a free week of audio experiences. I cannot recommend Endel enough. It has been truly helpful for me on my detox here. And I want to thank Endel for sponsoring us as well as you. Thank you viewers, subscribers. I could not do this without you. You're the MVPs. And now let's get into our session. All right, well, thank you so very much. I'm really excited about this session. I know we had our little intro already, but I'd love, we're starting now, you know? I'd love for you to just kind of imagine whether you picture roots spreading out, or star systems expanding or doorway, 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 doorway limitless, limitless doorways, paths just try to imagine all the different pathways that your manifestations can unfold through and really, when the manifestation includes your happiness, your well-being your success or anything of like a bigger con more general bigger context like that owning the perfect home having beautiful experiences being in a position where you can help other people more whatever the broader kind of ball of it is there are uncountable, we will never know how many ways, how many paths are open for that to come about. It's not one and done. It's forward, backward, and all this myriad of maze and web and connection and possibility. And things can happen in ways that you never, ever, ever, ever would have seen coming. And those are the best ways because those are the ways that we're not congesting and that's probably why it happens that way so much because we're not blocking up that path it came sneak attack for you <laughs> so I'd love for you to just feel where you are now connect with all of that all of those pathways and just accept them we're not trying to look down them we're not trying to figure it out or calculate it or force it or how can I put myself there right now, right? not about that. Just imagine how many possibilities there are. Endless. And then try to hold a vision of the inside of a clock or some type of gear system or some planetary influence cycles. There are things that need to unfold. There are things that we need to unfold within us before certain things happen so that we can sustain said certain thing that we're wanting to happen or create it's all like gears and working it's all moving through it's reliable though it's almost like being in high school or school in general or really anywhere that you're watching the clock and just being looking at that clock like oh when is this period going to end or when is that bell gonna ring so I can get on the bus and go home we can't force ahead time but what helps it helps when you're busy doing something writing a note to your friend doing the problem on the board planning your weekend whatever that's when time seems to go kind of quick not that we're trying to speed up time but just in this little this little example here <laughs> that's when we don't even notice and it shows up and here we are right so, we're just trying to connect with that, kind of anchor it in, and because there's always things to do, 
prepare yourself. But behind the scenes, we're trying to let it all just happen. Let it happen. <laughs> if you're like a Damon Paula fan, right? So we're gonna light a candle, and yes, we are gonna focus on our request. What do we want, right? We're gonna focus on our wish. on it and we're gonna let it go. We're not gonna worry about how it comes up. We're not gonna worry about getting out ahead of it and making it happen. We're just gonna allow. Just On behalf of the highest and greatest good and perfect comfort. Perfect, 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 perfect alignment. Okay? Now's your time. This is the moment to focus on a wish. And you can use this session or this method time and time and time again. So if you've got a big thing that you want, I would encourage you first to Build your confidence with smaller things. Something like, I'll give you an example that happened to me yesterday, uh, not yesterday, but very recently. I was talking to my dude about um, face masks, like sleeping masks. And we were just, I was just driving, because I call him when I'm driving. <clears throat> if, you know, whatever, I was in the car driving. And he was saying how his eyes are dry and his doctor told him to get a sleep mask and I was like, oh yeah, I want to get a sleep mask too. I've been thinking about a sleep mask. And literally, like the next day or very soon, I had a sleep mask company <laughs> reach out to me and send me a free sleep mask because I really just was like, here's the key. Oh yeah, I want one of those. I'll look for one or yeah, I'm going to get one. I'm going to get one. I wasn't like, oh, let me rush to Amazon. Let me research. I was just like, yeah, I can get the, yeah, sure. I can, I can afford a sleep mask. Yeah. And it was just like literally there, like it literally manifested. And those things happen all the time. I think of a cord that I need and I find the cord like in the middle of a parking lot, <laughs> like an aux cord or something like out of nowhere. And I'm like, oh wow. Yeah. I needed this. Thank you. So, my point is, I would encourage you to practice with this in a nice, loose way with little things first. A sleep mask, an eye, an aux cord, something kind of silly that you maybe don't care so much about. A deck of cards, a new bracelet, a new journal, something kind of that you really know you could get, you know. That journal costs, I don't know how much are journals nowadays, right? Everything's so expensive. That journal costs 25 bucks because it's a really nice one. And I know I have $25 in my account, but like, I'll get it sooner or later. Yeah, I'll get that. You know? So just think of yours. And I'm not trying to make you go small either. If you want to go big, go big. I'll give you an example of my big one that's sticking forever. And that's a studio because <laughs> they're really expensive or I have to share one and it's been tricky and I've been trying to force it I've been trying to force it but it's gonna happen at the right time and what I can focus on is still making the content I want to make and trusting that my beautiful lovely gracious audience is okay with the background sound until I you know get to the level where I can afford a proper studio or I move and I can build a proper one in my home until the right thing manifests for me. A 
Alright, so just have a look. This little glow, these little lights, these little dancing helpers here, pathways, gateways, doors, telephones. Put in the request for the face mask, <laughs> for a new lip pencil, I don't know, for like a tank top that you can wear all the time. I don't know, something easy or something big, but be prepared because we're gonna let it go. We're letting it go and we're trusting the universe got the message, I know what I want, all in divine alignment, all in perfect manifestation. Just send it into the light, the warmth, the glow, Ever changing, that it is flexible, they are not a hard path, they are forming and connecting in respect to what is absolutely perfect for you, for your wishes, for your sustainability, for your peace, for your comfort. I think I've shared before. Forcing it, I'm not blaming myself, but I'm just saying. I did get a little settlement. I did take some trips, but in hindsight, I probably wouldn't have, you know, chosen that. So we want to be empowered in our manifestations enough to trust that they will unfold perfectly for us. Things happen. 
laissez faire my french speaking audience please correct me okay i'm gonna spray on my palm Fossilized resin. So picture whatever comes to mind when you think of amber, when you think of resin, when you think of sap and the process of it. Or maybe this glow speaks to you. So just slow down, not rush things. Remember that there's so many things working behind the scenes in your favor. Don't complicate them, don't reroute them. Follow your heart, follow what's right for you, and make yourself happy. It sounds selfish, right? Make yourself happy. That's your one task here. Because your happiness, excuse me, your happiness is your guide. Your happiness, your joy, your truth unfolds more pathways, more doorways, more conversations, more connections, more understanding. I wonder if I will show that little window. 
wrap yourself up in some resin and some sap and some honey and just be one <laughs> be one with the honey right now watch how it lights you up activates inspires connects heals just doing what feels right not what can I do to make this happen just doing what feels right and just because we have a little light theme going on Mind overriding the heart 
because again we know what we want and we think well how can I make this happen and yeah there's there's something to that don't get me wrong but it's also again going back to our theme here of letting things happen especially these manifestations that you feel you've been trying to force and they're not working out right so we want to focus on connecting to the heart space Healing here, balancing, empowering, and bridging up to the to the mind, the throat, the problem solver, the amazing yet overcomplicator, you know. Bridging, charging the throat and the heart. Link, bridge. Let your, what did my astrologer said this one? Let your heart eclipse your mind. Just brushing this all out of your aura. The 
children membrane. All the programs, all the projections, all the expectations. I'm just gonna go to your side. that I have for myself and focusing on sharing them with you. This peaceful state, it really is. It really is. Not to be goofy, but it really is super tranquil to just get out of your own way, <laughs> get out of the way of the universe. you out, you surf them, or you stand in them, they hit and cleanse you, they hit and release. Right, well, thank you so, so, so very much for allowing me to share a little piece of your path tonight, and thank you so much for being such an important piece of mine. Please forgive the self-promotion here, I just need to, it's important. Um, if you love Kind of content and you're looking for more catalogs. I have a lot going on over on Patreon each month and there's a big back history you can all root through like a like a record crate digger. <laughs> um, I hope you know what I'm trying to say when I say that. Like an RJD2, like a DJ Shadow. You can find the, the bits you like there and it's a great way to support the channel for that studio one day or whatever the case may be. So thank you so very much. Again, I can't thank you enough. Just sending so much love to you. So very much love. All right. <laughs>